ain't nobody real no, no more. They ain't real no more. Body parts <gasps> bought from the stove. For real. Everybody got a cash, cash app. app. His baby mama trying to find out what where the cash is. He spent the rent money on the stripper. His boys pumped him up and told him tip her. Them same homeboys trying to get his girl. Then he found that she like girl. 50 the new 30. Tap into the movement at hermuseum.org and Sugar Tea Official YouTube. Let's go. All right, man, tragedy has struck in the Nick Cannon family and his girlfriend. Now, Nick Cannon announced early Tuesday morning that his youngest son, Zen, has died from a brain tumor. Now, he made the announcement, you know, on the Nick Cannon show Tuesday morning, telling his audience that his five-month-old son passed away after suffering from you know, pretty much fluid build up in the cavities of the brain and it pretty much it said increases increases the size of the ventricles, putting pressure on the brain. Sad, sad story. Tragedy nonetheless. Now Canon forty one said that the tumor developed quickly around Thanksgiving and he broke down in tears on his show. Um he said he spent, you know, the past weekend in California to share his last minutes with, you know, um, his son, Zen. Now, the actor took his son on a trip to the beach on Sunday, and Nick held Zen for the last time. He died soon after. Now, Zen is Nick's seventh child delivered in June by his third girlfriend, Allison Scott. He was the fourth of Nick Cannon's children born within the past year and a half with twin Zillion, Zion, born in June, and his daughter, Powerful, born last December. Now, the seven children are with four different women, including his ex-wife, Mariah Carey, ex-girlfriend, Brittany Bell, his current partner, Abby De La Rosa, and Scott, a model who appeared on one of Nick Cannon's music videos. Now, anyone that's a parent can definitely, you know, uh, sympathize and empathize because, you know, they always say that you never want to bury your child and I you know me just having a son that's two years old I couldn't imagine I could not imagine having to you know knowing that he was going to pass away and bury him and my heart goes out to Nick Cannon from the family here at hip-hop news uncensored our condolences our well wishes really go out to him from the bottom of our heart because this is tragic to say n nonetheless and um you never kind of get over something like this. You know, you you never do. You know, people, when you lose a loved one, it's something you kind of just learn to cope with over the years. It never kind of gets better. You just kind of learn to manage going through the time. So, um, sad situation, sad, sad situation. That's why I always say it's a blessing. Every day is a blessing. And it's always a blessing when you can have, you know, um, children that are healthy. I was blessed with a healthy son. And, you know, because I wasn't the healthiest of kids. I was on respirators. You know, um, had bad asthma when I was younger, and I just just so glad that I was able to have a healthy kid, free, you know, of all you know um, ailments, diseases, and things like that. So that's a blessing. And um, yeah, man, it, it's, I know that has to be hard for Nick. I know it has to be super hard. And then come out and still do your show and announce that on your show. That's terrible, man. That's just terrible thing. So like I always say here, man, we got a lot of people that watch this channel. Go to his page. It may help him, it may not. Go send him some well wishes, you know, uh, condolences to him. Uh, send him a Twitter message. Any little thing to help at this time. Like I said, you'll never be able to get over it, but you can cope down the road. So, again, man, you know, you, you, you never promise tomorrow. You never promise the next hour. I mean, you can go out the house, you know, it could be the last time. Or you could be with your family member for the last time. So the best thing to do would be able to just to cherish the moments that you're with, with your family. Love them, hug them, kiss them, hold them, tell them that you love them. And, you know, nobody really knows what happens when we go to the other side, if there's an other side. But all we could do for right now is just, you know, try to leave the best impression that we can on people. Show the purest form of love to the people that we love. And, um... It's just not fair. It's just not fair to have to bury your child. So once again, man, from the family here at Hip Hop News Uncensored, condolences. And um, we definitely appreciate all 
what Nick Cannon has contributed to music, to media, to movies. We may not agree with everything that he does or says, but we definitely appreciate his contribution. And um, hopefully, you know, he could be comforted comforted through this very, very difficult time for Nick Cannon. But it's your brother, Old God Man Hip Hop News Uncensored. Like I said, go send him some love. Go send him some well wishes. And um, I definitely appreciate you guys listening to what I had to say all of this time. It's your boy, Old God Man. Make sure you guys subscribe to Hip Hop News Uncensored for more exclusives just like this one. Also, make sure that you guys follow us on social media, man. If you go down into the description box, you can find the website, which is Hip Hop un.com you can also find our twitter page follow us there our instagram page follow us there and our facebook page make sure you guys actually follow us there and like i said man we're going to keep on banging out this news for you and hopefully you guys have a blessed beautiful beautiful day and i'll be back tonight with more videos man we're going 365 seven days a week here on hip-hop news on sense keeping you updated keeping you updated on the latest hip-hop news trending stories from all around the world say it with your boy man hip-hop news on sense is the vibe so subscribe peace